Hey guys, NES Addict here, and I'm super excited to be broadcasting from my brand new, freshly remade game room. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to take you step by step through taking everything out of here, making some updates, and putting it all back in. Why, you ask? So I can show you step by step how to make a game room in a small space. All that and more next. Alright guys, here we go. I'm about to go in and just start pulling stuff out of here. Let's go. Come with me for this one. Alright, so I boxed up about half the NES games. We got more to do. Let's keep going. Thanks, nostalgic numbnuts. Totally rad. J Love eighty one gave me this. I don't know if I should try to pull this whole thing out or what. Let's try it. Mind you, there's still stuff on the bottom of this, so... You guys probably don't ever get to see this, but this thing is amazing. It's a Masters of the Universe wind socket. And dude, it is beautiful. I got this in like 2016 or 2017 at a yard sale for 50 cents. Who knows how long these people had had it. But when I saw it, I knew I had to have it. This thing is ridiculous. Alright guys, so this is what my game room looks like with pretty much nothing in it. You can see the little crack that leads over to the Wii U kiosk. But uh, yeah, if you look out this, it's my front, my front window. <laughs> pretty crazy. So yeah, this is where you guys usually see me. Oh, right over there. But we're going to paint all these walls. See, this wall is gray. I don't know if you can tell. 
But then when you look over at this wall, it's like a light blue. Probably can't tell that. Maybe if I do that, you might be able to see the difference. Anyway, we're going to patch all these holes where my uh, hangers used to be. And we're just going to put a fresh coat of paint on this thing. And then we're going to rebuild a game room.